These can't be our only choices, Mr. Beale. I mean, come on. Each girl is uglier than the next. Look, finding a gorgeous pregnant woman who's willing to give her baby to a couple with a criminal record isn't exactly a walk in the park. I don't care if it's a walk in the sewer. We are hemorrhaging money into your bank account, and I expect to see results. Sheldon, no one is happier than I am. Okay, I need to ask you guys something, and I need you to be totally honest with me. Of course. Yeah. Is this side of my face fatter than this side? No. Wow. Are you jealous of him? Because you think he's funnier than you? Honey. I don't think he's funnier than me. Oh, he's funnier than me. Um, he's not funny at all. How can I help? <laughs> you can't. I don't trust you, Cheryl. So don't trust me. Watch me like a hawk. Tell me the barest minimum. But let me help you help Polly. You think Polly's crazy? I do. I think she's crazier than a serial killer on bath salts, but so what? She's carrying Jason's baby. That trumps everything. Daddy's still recovering from his breakdown. He's a way better hook than you. So they got married, and they had me. Oh. And then my sister. You look smaller than yesterday. Is that possible? He's down three ounces. I say that's an understatement. Who would have thought that teaching a kid to surf would teach me that surfing isn't the most important thing in the world? And that something else is. Love. Bigger than any tidal wave. More powerful than any fear. And you know why? Because I'm a pusher. I push people. I pushed my husband into law school. That was a bust. I pushed myself into working three jobs. And now, I'm gonna push you because I know you're smarter than this. Thanks, Miss Norbury. And if there's anything I can do for extra credit, please let me know. Oh, I will. Tomorrow? It'll take that long? Shouldn't we stop to make camp? No, that'll take longer. We can keep going. But th there's robbers in the woods. Whoa, time out, Shrek. Camping's definitely starting to sound good. Hey, come on. I'm scarier than anything we're going to see in this forest. I need to find somewhere to camp now! Susie. Dustin, come on. She's not there. She's there, all right? She'll pick up. Maybe Cerebro doesn't work. Or maybe Susie doesn't exist. She exists. She's a genius and she's hotter than Phoebe Cates. No girl is that perfect. Is that so? I mean... You're perfect. Of course. If you did want to talk to this guy, there's no safer place than the office. I don't think this sounds like a good idea. Been chasing this thing for so long, I, I never really thought about the day after. I don't know. What about you? I'm done with all this madness. Time to start over. You should do the same. That's easier said than done. Hi. Remember me? Another leak in 26, apparently. I don't see that here. What? They called like 40 minutes ago, said it was worse than last time. I brought the whole crew out on a Saturday. Why if I have a look at that? Sterling. One second. What'd I tell you about over pouring? Uh, your breakage is higher than any other bartender. I'm cultivating loyal customers. Uh, you're cultivating tips and ass. Stick to the measurements. What the hell are you doing? I thought I was hitching a ride to Rikers so we could interview some convicts I put away, but apparently you're still wasting time investigating me. Hey, it's your fault we have to check up on your power outages. You have three mini fridges plugged into the same outlet. Three mini fridges are cheaper than one regular one. We're just doing our jobs. Why don't you trust us? Well, a wooden plane. It's about time trees were good for something instead of just standing there like jerks. The plywood pelican was larger than a football field. It weighs more than the state of New Hampshire. It was only flown once by its creator, Mr. C. Montgomery Burns. Man, I got this close to him, and Monica need me in the back. <laughs> What's going on? We were just wondering if Chandler's girlfriend's a girl. Oh, well, just ask her how long she's gonna live. Women live longer than men. <laughs> You're older than me. <laughs> I was gonna say husband. You have to deal with them head on, no matter how scary they may be. 
Because once you do, you'll see that you can go further than you ever imagined. You're a lucky man. But are they way more expensive than regular eggs? Way more. Ooh, I'll take a dozen. Do you know what kind of person becomes a psychologist, Britta? A person that wishes deep down that everyone more special than them was sick because healthy sounds so much more exciting than boring. You're average, Britta Perry. You're every kid on the playground that didn't get picked on. I don't think you really understand who you're hunting. This man, he is much more dangerous than your agents. I'll take my chances with Homeland. Catherine, you're missing it. Coming. You know, Richard, there are a few things in life more difficult than the loss of a parent. Who wants margaritas? <laughs> Over here. What did I miss? Sids. What? Well, we have to go get him. No, Gargamel is more powerful than ever. Papa said no matter what happens, we're not to go back for him. He's trying to protect us. No, we can't leave Papa behind. It was a smart promise. No, 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 we can't. We promised Papa we'd do exactly what he said. That's right. 